Hello friends, in this video we will be synthesizing 1 chlorohexane by the chlorination of 1 hexanol using thionyl chloride. Chemicals required are 12.5 ml of 1 hexanol and 22 ml of thionyl chloride. This experiment is adapted from Vogel's textbook of practical organic chemistry. A 500 ml 3 neck round bottom flask is placed in a heating mantle stirrer. A reflex condenser is attached on the center neck and an addition funnel on one of the side neck. The other side neck is left free so that reagents can be charged into it. 22 ml of thionyl chloride was added to the round bottom flask and the side neck is stoppered. With the steering turned on, 12.5 ml of 1 hexanol is added via the addition funnel. The addition of 1 hexanol to the thionyl chloride is exothermic, so be careful with the addition and go slowly. Once everything is added, reflex the mixture for 1 hour to let the reaction go into completion. The apparatus was then rearranged for distillation and distillation was conducted slowly. Initially, thionyl chloride distills over from 80 degrees C to approximately 120 degrees Celsius. Then the flask at the receiving end was swapped to another clean round bottom flask. And everything that distilled over at 131 degrees C was collected in a receiving flask. It was then transferred to a 125 milliliter separatory funnel and then the crude product was washed successively with distilled water and then with 10% sodium carbonate solution and again with distilled water. This would give us somewhat pure product which would be having lot of water in it. So to remove the water we will be adding anhydrous sodium sulfate and we will get a clear solution and this is the 1 chlorohexane. If you want you can redistill the 1 chlorohexane to get a much pure product but since I am lazy to do that I am ending the procedure here. So that's all in this video. The yield was about 6.75 grams which is exactly the same written in the Vogel's textbook of practical organic chemistry. Hope you have enjoyed my video. These are all my Patreon supporters who are financially helping me so that I am able to purchase new equipments and chemicals required for doing new videos. You can also support me via Patreon or PayPal. The links of both of them are given in the description.